Street Fighter is pretty forgiving in terms of input. To do the power bomb, all I gotta do is kind of roll my fingers, right? Roll my fingers backwards like this. But if you play Tekken or Dead or Alive or some of the other fighting games, the inputs may not be as forgiving. If you roll your fingers like this really quickly, the down input's gonna be missing. If we do this slowly, we can get it every time. But in the heat of battle, you don't got time for that. You gotta be able to do it quickly. Now the reason why the down is missing is because the left button or the back button here does not have time to retract or go up yet before we press the next button. Now the trick here is to tap the back button really quickly and then let go. Then you can do a quarter circle forward movement like that. And when we do this quick enough, now you see that the down button has time to register. And as this back button begins to go up, when we press down really quickly, it's going to register as down back. And then you just complete the motion after that. There we go. Same thing in Dead or Alive here. It doesn't work. The down input is missing. But if you just tap this wheel quickly, let go so that the back button has a chance to go up before you press down, down forward and forward, just like this. Look at that. Now it's working. And I can get this pretty much every time. See that? Just let the back button recover first. Alright, hopefully you found that to be helpful. If you did, give the video a like, subscribe for more, and take care now.